Good morning. It's Thursday, um, the 16th. Yeah. I say good morning, but I'll be honest with you. This has been a really rough week, and it's not like anything that I can't handle, but it's just been one of those weeks where you wake up and you wonder what's going to happen today. And I'm just so tired. I'm so tired. I don't think I slept very well last night. I'm just sorry. This is going to be a very truthful vlog this morning. But um, <clears throat> I know we all have days like this. So I know you guys understand. It's just, um, it happens. I mean, but unfortunately, I seem to be having a week like this. Um, I guess that would explain the breakouts because usually that either comes from one of two things and the other thing is stress. So, um, yeah, I mean like this morning, I'm running late. It's almost 9.30. I'm supposed to be at work at 9. Um, I have to feed all the animals before I leave and maybe I should show you that routine because I'm telling you. It takes a good 20 minutes or so um, to get them all fed and, you know, put, get Penis, I can't even talk, get Guinness put up in his kennel and all that. And this morning, um, he, he wanted to take his sweet time, which is normal. He usually does. Um, and it's okay because I really need to have somebody staying home with him. Um, because... You know, the kids have been at mom and dad's, like, they're usually there the entire summer. And especially this summer because mom and dad have a pool. And so they're constantly in the pool and, you know, they just haven't wanted to come home, which I understand. And mom and dad only live five minutes from us. But it makes it a little bit harder. And then Guinness has to go in the kennel and he really needs to be uh, able to come out because he's used to that which I mean he's doing fine he's doing really well but and he doesn't whine or anything like that but um, and he goes right in he loves his kennel but it would be cool to have like somebody there for him so he could be out a little bit during the day um, let's see what else I woke up with heartburn I still haven't got rid of that Blech. okay oh I went to um, give the cats some ice in their water bowl and I I don't know how I did it to be honest with you I'm trying to figure out how but anyway when I pulled the tray out to get some ice I actually pulled the tray out completely and dumped a whole full tray of ice onto my kitchen floor and so then I had to get the broom and sweep all the ice up while Guinness is running through it like a madman because he's like ice 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 he loves ice anyway um, <laughs> yeah let's just hope this day gets a little smoother so um, let's see what happens at the office maybe it'll be a good day after all but after uh, a whole week of this I'm not really that hopeful. <laughs> okay, I am at work now and things are better because I have cinnamon roll coffee. And guess what mom made? And I know this is not a healthy breakfast, okay? So no comments, please. I know this. Ginger snaps. And that's all she had left out of, I don't know how many, like four dozen, I think. Anyway. 32 okay almost four dozen anyway she uh she told me i could have the rest so guess what i'm having for breakfast and there's patrick does patrick want to be vlogged today you don't care does faith want to be vlogged today nope okay so daddy didn't answer you okay Patrick's going to put some water in my radiator because it really needs it but he's checking with dad on something anyway or my husband, which is his dad. You get it. This is the study that I'm doing for a year where I have to Should track I have my sleep 
So, yeah, go ahead. Sometimes Dan got through. Oh, shoot. No. He is trenching rock today. He said if he didn't answer it, send him a text and wait for him to answer. Um, so, anyway. So, this is my computer that I use at work. Actually, it's my computer that I use at home, too. It's just my laptop. And this is my study that I've been doing um, for this Penn University. Um, about sleep sleeplessness anyway because you know y'all know I don't sleep too well and so they asked me to take part in this for a year and but I have a chance every um every month one in three chance to win like up to a thousand dollars so it's totally worth it and um why is it on vibrate okay so anyway I've got my computer set up oh yeah you haven't seen my desk have you there's my typewriter there's my invoice books, the Rolodex, my folder, or why can't I ever remember what these things are called? Trays. Yeah. <laughs> and I, this is work that I'm waiting on. This is filing, and you can see that my trays are empty, so I've been working hard. And um, so that's about it. And then I've got my calendar, Hi. and... Are you busy? Yep, this is it. So, I'm gonna get to work. First, I'm gonna fill this out. Then I'm gonna get to work. Still look at the road. Okay, we are going to the movies. It is four o'clock. Look like that. Let's see what time is it. It is four thirteen. The movie starts at four fifty, and. One of the other advantages of having your mother for a boss is that you can get off early sometimes. So, me and Patrick are going to see a movie. Patrick, do you want to let everybody know which movie we're going to see? The Gallows. You can turn around and look at them. They would love to see you. They haven't seen you in a long time. They saw me this morning. Well, not yet. Yeah. But... <laughs> well, technically they did. If you're saying that they didn't see me yet, then... Technically, they, did, they still haven't. Well, technically, they haven't seen this yet either. Yeah, that's I'm what I'm saying. So, I was I mean, recording like, the steering wheel. You seriously, you don't want to talk? I'm talking. I mean, goodness gracious. I'm talking right I, now. I give you my camera and I give you like total control to like turn it around. I'm and talking right now. Say anything you want to say. Well, almost anything. And <laughs> <laughs> and you're not doing it. I can make people really angry right now. Okay, well, look. Hey. Tell them what this is. It's, it's a popcorn bucket. It's the annual popcorn bucket. You buy it and then you can fill it up for $4. So we're gonna eat popcorn. Movie popcorn. Lots of butter. Will they come in here that's copyright? We have Man, a bucket of popcorn. See? For four bucks. Right, Patrick? What? You ready to see a scary movie? Cigarettes? We got popcorn. No way. Yay, with lots of butter. Patrick put lots of butter on it. So yeah, I'm gonna sit here. And I, I'm not really gonna do the screen because I don't want to get in trouble. But anyway, we have stadium seating in here, and of course, you know me. So, all right, ready for the scary movie? Okay, definitely going to see this one next. So. Without giving anything away, what'd you think? Awesome. <laughs> yeah, it was pretty good, wasn't it? It was really scary. And we demolished the popcorn. <laughs> Which we didn't eat for supper, so. Well, yeah, we did have popcorn for supper. Huh? I'm a bad mom so again. We're Taco Bell. <laughs> no, Make we're not doing Taco Bell. <laughs> yeah, i uh, No, it's okay. Hey guys, I am on my way to the storage and my husband is following me on the bike. Um, we got Harley Quinn back today. She's been worked on and um, I haven't talked to Sean but it looks like she's doing pretty well. Um, I'm listening to my CD that Faith made me. Uh, she made me a CD of the soundtrack of Love Rosie, which is a really good movie by the way. Me and Faith watched it. and. It may not be completely like little kid friendly, but it's really, really a good love story. Um, so I would recommend it for, you know, older 
women, it's kind of a chick flick. You know, like for not older women, you know what I mean. Just not little bitty kids. Anyway. So my husband is not feeling well right now. And he's been working outside all day and he's hot and tired and he's probably dehydrated even though I told him to drink plenty of water and he says he did. But anyway, so we're headed to the store to drop off Harley Quinn and then we're going to go back to Harley Davidson and get his company truck and then we'll be headed home. So, woo, the sun's bright this afternoon. So I'll see you later. Which one? We are at Angela's. I'm gonna get some cannoli. We are getting a whole pizza. Yum. <laughs> I love this place. I like this. Oh, it's when you need oven like that. I <laughs> Yeah, we need a big oven like that. Uh -huh. mm -hmm. So we can make all kinds of pizzas. That would be great. Yeah. Our pizza is going to be ready soon. <laughs> hmm, I already asked. <laughs> I got permission. <laughs> I hope you got me a good light. Oh yeah, you look fine. <laughs> oh, I like that. Look. We need one of those too, as a courtesy to the kitchen. Patrons are requested to kiss the chef. Oh. Well, I didn't see that. Kiss the chef. Oh yeah, she probably, she it probably, is, but I'm gonna it. I'm gonna eat it tonight later on. Wow. Yeah. <laughs> Set it over here. I love those things. Oh my gosh, it's like the best one I've ever had. They're amazing. Yeah, but the more chocolate, the better. <laughs> Angelos. This is dessert for tonight. Mm -hmm. Yep, yeah, that's dessert for tonight.